Good morning. It's day 10. My car didn't start this morning, so uh, I've been hanging out in the casino. And uh, now it's time. It's 1030, and uh, I opened up the hood, as you might see here, to uh, help everything dry out. I got to find a tarp or something to put on this guy. This is getting to be kind of a pain in the rear here. So, um, so I'm going to start it here in just a second. And I thought you might enjoy sharing the pain or the joy with me, <laughs> depending on how it is. Gonna unlock the car. Cool. Unlock this door. This is the lock on my door. Pushed up is locked, but there's no keyhole on that side, which is kind of strange. And I need to put this side down. I gotta put the phone down for a minute, folks. Sorry about that. Okay. There we go. Same with the side. Just a minute here now. I'll set you down. <laughs> this is so weird. Okay, hang on a minute. I needed two hands to lock up that hood thing. So, all right, we're in. We're gonna keep our fingers crossed. We're gonna insert the key. And we're gonna sit back and we're all gonna listen and hope like heck it starts. Okay, here we go. Oh, it doesn't sound promising, does it? Come on, baby. Oh, that almost sounds like a battery. Oh no. Well, we'll have to figure it out, I guess. Ta-da! Good old AAA. I'm gonna give them a call and see if they can't come and help me get my car started. Uh, I'm thinking they can uh, just charge up my battery or give me a push start or something to get me started then I can uh, go find out what's going on with the battery maybe get it recharged up or something but uh, I'm not sure why it was run down but it wasn't going to start at anything the way it was AAA has said that uh, it's going to be about an hour and they're going to send somebody and uh, that'll be cool um, so We'll have to just wait around and uh, see what happens when they... Some more interesting things. It's uh, getting darker over there. Looks like it may be uh, raining a little bit and I think it's coming this way. <laughs> oh, the fun never stops, does it? Uh, I talked with Chris and he thinks that uh, I, I need to get it started, which I can do by pushing it or by jumping it uh, with uh, another six volt battery, which I think the um, AAA guy has because I gave them that instructions. And then he suggests getting the battery recharged before I move forward, which I think is a great idea. Um, he thinks it's just, I don't know. I, I, I'm assuming he thinks it just needs to be recharged. So 
Uh, so that's what I'm going to do, find somebody here in town, and perhaps the tow people that come uh, can do that. So we'll see. Bye-bye <laughs> for now. So now the uh, tow guy came from AAA, gave me a push, and it started right up. And so uh, I texted Chris and talked to, talked to him a little bit, and he suggested I get the battery charged up because it had gone really not enough energy to uh, turn the motor over. So it's being charged now, and I had to take it out of the box, which is under the seat, so I had to remove the seat. Um, so uh, that's, that's what's happened, and I bought a tarp because it's it's of course it's raining now it just started so uh, i may be staying the night here in the o'reilly uh in the o'reilly uh storefront you never know but anyway that's uh that's where it's at and uh i'll get it back in and it, it would, should have a good charge and it should start up and uh i think what i'm going to do is go back to the uh casino uh, because it's supposed to rain this afternoon some more and uh, then starting tomorrow it's all big balls of sun so I think we'll just take our, our shot and, and uh, do that that's my story now <laughs> while I'm uh, waiting for the battery to charge I'm coming up to get a bite of, to eat and a beer and look at this this is the place that's across the street it's like, oh my. I hope this isn't a sign of some type. Better not be, <laughs> he says. Anyway, uh, I should know what's going on in an hour and a half or so. Nothing like a nice ice cold IPA from Lander Brewing Company in Wyoming. And that's what this is. And uh, <laughs> calm the nerves a little bit. Settle down. Uh, the plan is to pick up the battery when it's charged. Put it back in. The little box under the seat. Put the seat back together again. And hopefully it starts because it's tarped so the rain's not getting into it and drive it back to the casino and re-tarp it and lock it up for the night and the next four days are all big balls of sun in this particular region all the way over to jackson so that's the plan i'm gonna stick to and i'm gonna just calm myself down and relax so that's my story again. Well, this has been an exciting day, and I'm in bed already, and it's uh, quarter to five. <laughs> uh, the battery charged up. It took an hour and a half to charge it, and uh, went back in real slick-like, got tied down, and uh, the seats went back in pretty smoothly and uh, everybody in the shop there were five people in there all came out to see if it was going to start and it did start and I got a big round of applause <laughs> that old car is a real draw I hear, I'm here to tell you people just stop and stare at it and they all want to know what year is it and it's like, I should get a t-shirt. It's like, my car is 1937. Um, it, it, uh, it ran well coming back. I stopped and got gas um, and uh, got it back here to the casino, tarped it up. The good news is that the room tonight, because it's Sunday night, is half the price that it was last night because it was Saturday night. So that's good, and uh, it looks like it might rain a little bit, but not too much tonight. I'm hoping that's the case. Anyway, um, 
what a day. But, you know, that's kind of the way it goes. And so this was the first time we kind of had a, a major kind of event. And it turned out to be just pretty easy. Uh, the way they made those old cars, though, it's not easy to get into some of those items like the battery. Um, but, oh well. Uh, thanks, Chris, for the tools you gave me. They all fit the uh, various nuts and bolts just great. <laughs> so uh, that's the day. I'm pretty done. I'm going to have a bite to eat. And I'm going to uh, go down and play slot machine. And then I'm going to bed early because so, I want to get up early tomorrow and get started. So that's, that's the exciting day I had today. I hope you all enjoyed and uh, I will catch up to you tomorrow. So let me tell you once again, sayonatra, Frank.